billionaire businessman, Yvon Chouinard, is giving away his company, Patagonia, to a trust dedicated to fighting the impact of climate change. This news is raising the bar for sustainability initiatives around the world. Other billionaires have established philanthropic foundations. Many have joined the Giving Pledge, created by Warren Buffett, Bill and Melinda Gates, and are committed to giving the majority of their wealth to charitable causes. But by giving away all the future profits of one of the world's most successful sportswear brands, Chouinard has set the bar at a new high. Never again will sustainability be seen as a mere corporate box-ticking exercise. Of course, most business leaders do not have the option to follow Chouinard's example because they manage rather than own their company. Even so, they have the option to act in a way that could have a truly game-changing impact on the future of the planet. As I explain in my new book, Profit from the Source, what they need to do is to empower their chief procurement officer to work more closely with the top suppliers to meet the company's environmental, social and governance obligations. In this endeavor, suppliers are integral to the success of a company. That's because they typically account for anywhere between 77 and 90 percent of a company's carbon emissions and a significant share of the risks in relation to the broader ESG factors. So by instructing the CPOs to work more closely with them on sustainability issues, CEOs can expect to make a difference. Some, like the Wall Street Journal, in a review of my book, have reacted skeptically to this suggestion. Surely, they say, the one and only job of the CPO is to cut costs. How can they possibly have time to do anything else? I beg to disagree. Yes, generating cost savings is a central task to the CPO. But as owners of the corporate relationship with suppliers, they can contribute to the success of their company in many other ways, including by promoting sustainability. Setting ambitious science-based carbon reduction targets for suppliers and then monitoring progress, playing a central role in the redesign of the products themselves, their packaging and more broadly the product portfolio, and incorporating social and governance expectations in a supplier code of conduct, commissioning formal third-party compliance audits and terminating relationships when necessary. These are some of the ways the CPO can help their company have a game-changing impact on the future of the planet. I'm Christian Schuh and this has been a new segment of my channel Procurement in the Park. Thank you for watching and if you are a first-time visitor please hit the bell and subscribe. Bye!